Hello everybody, this is just a little introduction. This is about CERN and the robot's gonna read some as well as me talk. This is America. We have the founding fathers that wrote a constitution that we haven't lived by in 142 years. Hello everybody, how you doing? Hope everybody's doing fine. We're gonna do us a little update. You want to? I do. We got the dog leg ground. Don't forget about the PDF that I put up for y'all. As you see, it's been dropping ground. And I got some more stuff to show you. Now, as you see up here, it says beam energy, zero, zero, all zeros. Now, the other day, before we go, let's click on this one. Look, did you see the first one? And then you seen this one, right? Okay, let's go back. Now, we're going to click on this one. Remember the other day up here in this corner right here, where it says GEV energy equals zero. There, now, are showing you that there is zero energy, period. They're not doing anything. But, what is this? How are they doing that without no energy? Huh. They're still colliding particle beams, but they have no energy. Hmm. Really now. There's another one. And here's another one. Now, we're going to close this one out. We're going to close this one out. We're going to close this one. I'll close this one. We'll close that one and that one. And we'll go back to this. Now, this is the main one. Oh, right, let's do one other. Let's go over here. Let me move this over so you can see where I'm going. I'm over here. And let's just go down to the dashboard. Let's just see what the dashboard's doing. Oh, look at there. Zero energy. No charts are working. Really? Are you kidding? Uh, uh, I'm just amazed. They ain't doing nothing. Aren't y'all? Look, nothing showing up. As usual. So let's go back to... Uh, where is it? Right here. Alright. But they're not doing anything, though. No, no, this chart don't mean nothing, guys. It, it don't mean nothing. And this green... All, you know, none of that means anything. Not not enough. It don't mean not not a thing. No sorry. Let's see. Uh, and this one? Nah, it don't mean anything either. Nope, it don't mean nothing either. Not not even one little iota. They got no energy. It don't mean anything. And this right here, since it just refreshed again and gave us a new one, uh, that don't mean anything either. Move along, folks. Move along. Everything's okay. You, there, there's nothing going on. Uh, bullshit. Nothing going on. Bullshit. Let's wait for this. Let's let's open this one. Oh man, there ain't nothing going on. Look at there. Not nothing. No, I mean, not nothing. Nothing's happening. Here. Not nothing at all. Move along, folks. Move along. <laughs> Hey, let's look at this one. Oh man, there ain't nothing happening. Nothing happened at all. Move along, folks. Move along. Nothing's happening. Uh, we ain't got no power. We're not doing anything. We're not showing you the power because we don't want you to know exactly what we're doing. Uh, that oh man, they're they're showing up lit up chart. Look at this. Everything is green, folks. But they're not doing anything. No siree. They're not doing a damn, not not one thing. Look at there. Not, not, not nothing. They're not doing anything. No, sir. They ain't doing nothing. Nothing. Oh, look at there. <laughs> five, five, 2016. And well, look at here. Look at, look at what the date says. <laughs> 2012. They're not doing anything. No. They, they they ain't doing nothing, folks. Not nothing. No, they ain't doing nothing. 
Nothing at all. Let's see what. Doesn't got any date on it. Uh, yeah. It's <laughs> May fifth. <laughs> but they're not doing anything, folks. They're not. They're not doing anything. No, sir. Not. Not even one little iota. No, sir. Uh. Uh. They're just lying to you. That's all. Look at, see, it changed again. Let's go back. Let's wait for this to refresh one more time. We got to wait 30 seconds. <clears throat> it's feed time, folks. Are getting close to it. And she let me know. The bird's talking in the background. One of the dogs is tiptoeing. She's got real long toenails, and if you cut them, she cries like a uh, like you beating her with a stick. And so she walks back and forth on the floor just to aggravate you. That, that's her little trick. Uh, oh, hey, hey, we refresh. Let, let's look, look at the chart. You want to uh, look at there? Look at it. See, you saw it change all on your own. But they're not doing nothing, folks. Nothing. No power, no beams, uh, no nothing. They, they're not running any power. None. And they're not running any. Look, they even got something down here rogue. See, they, they got something down here rogue, but they're still crashing particle beams. Uh, oh, really? How are they doing that? Don't know. Uh, Let's see. Who built their website? Who built these links? Hmm. CERN's itself. They got a huge, huge computer system. I, I mean, just tremendously big. Do you think they got just a few people that know that we're watching and we might be doing something? We might even be making a video to make a little controversy, a little propaganda for you. Let you know when, where, and how, what they're not doing, but when they really are doing. Uh, you know, look at here. Earthquakes. This is, well, let's go up for one day here. One day, right here. Well, maybe a little too much. Okay, that's supposed to be one day. It's just one day. Look at all of them. Look at all this. Now, I'm not sure, but it's not reported on USGS, and I don't see it. But my better half actually says she read a story today that said that we had an earthquake in Florida. Uh, it's not showing nowhere. Now, is that true? I don't know. Um, I can't prove it. I know she says she read it. Now, I believe her, but I don't see it shown on, the, you know, anywhere on Florida here. You, you see, there's there's no circle. It, it don't say nothing. So, I guess that's a Dutch sense fine there. He'll have to look that up because that's his uh, pet peeve with the earthquakes. Mine's with the large earthquakes. Now let's turn this up to five. <clears throat> And then let's turn this down. And then let's look. 6.7. All these has been in the last seven days now. 7.0, And what's that? Uh, it's a 5.9. And here's a 5.4. But we're also missing a couple because they're not showing. <laughs> that was a 7.3 that wasn't reported, and y'all all seen that on Dutch's Facebook page yesterday. They didn't report. It's not showing on here either. Ain't that odd? Yeah, sure is. Especially since it proved uh, Dutch sense one more time 100% positively correct in forecasting earthquake. Uh, forecasting earthquakes. That was a damn tongue twister. Uh, but now there you go. Just one more time, 100% correct. 
Now, I know that's three times of a perfect score every place got hit. But yet, there we go again. No one believes that because serves ain't operating. Uh, and they don't believe nothing like the sword. Listen, I'm going to start doing this because, you know, I want everybody to see. There's one guy there. There's a guy there. I, I, I'm saying guys, they might, they, a couple of them might be girls because I can't really tell. This one might be a girl, but I ain't going to say it's a girl, and I ain't going to say it's a guy. And that one could be a girl or a guy, too, or just got a ponytail, or that's just a black line. <laughs> also, he wants you to pay close attention to the monitors that they got running. See this one? This one up here. There's another one there with a bunch of little grass in it. But we're paying attention to what they look like today to compare to what they're going to look like tomorrow. These are white today for some reason. Yesterday they had a lot of black, these things in it, like a little block, a lot of black stuff writing. But hey, I'm just showing it to you because I want you to document it in your own head, you know, kind of like uh, Fruit Loops, F R U I T, and now it's spelled F R O O T. How many remember that? Y'all yeah, remember this too. All right. That's just one more thing. Sure is. They're not supposed to be there. Uh uh. It says 5 5 2016. They're going to be closed. Yeah, till 6 6 2016. Uh, really? Oh, key dokey then. The, well, were they anticipating doing something big and they don't want nobody to know it? If an earthquake or a volcano erupts again, a big earthquake or a big volcano, they don't want nobody to know. Uh, I bet your sweet ass that's what they're going to do. Yes, sir. Uh-huh. Can I prove when, where, how, what time? Nope. There ain't enough information. No, sir, they ain't. No. But I can assure you that this thing running right here to dog leg ground like that, and going straight to ground, it's making that plasma move. So that means you're going to have some earthquakes. Also means you're going to have what? An erupting volcano. We just had one the other day. I made a video letting everybody know that CERNs were still operating and they was bullshitting you. Yes, I did. Sure, as did. And what happened? You go over to Dead Sense's channel on YouTube. Let's just go over here. Um, well, let's go. Let's just go to Dutch's channel. How about that? I know it's over here, so we'll go over here. Come on, load up. Let's go. Let's go. We ain't got time for all that plan. Come on. And here you go. Seventy-five thousand eight hundred fifty-three views. Four days ago, just the other day. We reported the earthquake happenings. And what happens? None other than a volcano. Oh, and look here. Look here. Y'all might want to check them two videos out right there. Uh-huh. Especially the Earthquake Whisperer right here. Where it's showing you a big crack. Look at that. Big crack in the earth. You reckon that's plasma moving, causing the plates to shift a little bit? Mmm, I bet you it sure is. I, I do. Look at there. Dutch even done a video on green screen for the first time. That's pretty cool. But now look at here, folks. You know, laying all jokes aside, me being a smart ass, uh, you know, been a long day at work. And all of that, but you know, folks, there's a lot of things going on. And we got us a new candidate for president. We got really two of them, don't we? We got Hillary Clinton and Trump. Is Trump a good guy? Don't know. Is Hillary a good guy? Hell no, she's not. We don't know about Trump. Not really. 
But I will say this. He might be the worst guy, worst president in the world. And he might be the best. And he might really be for the people. He hollers democracy a little bit too much for me. But still, that's just me. Everybody knows that I'm in the forecast of getting abolishing corporate government. Period. Now, whether he is or not, I don't know. But you know how that goes. And by the way, folks, this is my fundraiser. So if you would, if you want to, and if you can, please help build the studio lab. I, I would appreciate it. Um, we got a long way to go for, or I got a long way to go before I can do it. It's not going to happen overnight, but it would be possible to do a lot more things. Maybe some of y'all remember my plasma, my antenna shooting off plasma off the, end tip, the tips of the antenna. I want to do that again. I want to do that in a lot different manner, though. I actually want to take the antenna and I want to build a glass encasement and fill it up with steam, moisture, make a, in, a, a climate cloud inside of a concealed unit. And then I want to key up the transmitter and see just what happens to the clouds. Now, you know, plasma is hot, right? Okay. <clears throat> and of course, if it's hot, we all know what's going to happen to the cloud, correct? Well, there's still some out there that says if it gets hot, well, we know that it's going to make it move. It can't be hot. Really? Well, let me explain this to y'all. Radio frequency transmitted. And if you create enough power in the right aspect, you can create a plasma. The same thing that they were doing to the atmosphere. They were creating a plasma with harp. Do y'all remember these days? Yeah. That's why we're going to revisit this. We're going to put the meta bunkers, basically. Mick West, the one to come up with a stupid idea anyway, we're going to throw his ass under the bus like it should be. So with that, folks, if you would, um, you can click on that. It should take you there. Well, nothing works. Why does nothing work, man? <laughs> God damn, man. Come over here, and this is it. It gives you the story, everything here. So, if you could come by, check it out. If you have the means, please donate. If you don't, no harm, no foul. Much love to y'all. Y'all all have a great day. From my cold, dead hands, abolish corporate government. All your freedoms. Much love to y'all. Y'all have a good day now, you hear? Hello, everybody. Well, looky here. I found something. It's going to interest you quite well. As you see, I found the way I remember Fruit Loops a long time ago. Well, not really a whole long time ago. I just can't prove how long ago anymore. Because everywhere you look, you see this, F-R-O-O-T, roots. But this is the way I remember it, F-R-U-I-T. Well, now we're going to do this live, okay? We're going to click on this link right here. 
we're going to open it and we're going to come over here to this page okay now you're going to be amazed at what you're fixing to see and I mean you're going to be amazed and the reason why I say that the same photo that you saw just a minute ago see same photo look see it same photo let's go back let's view the image so we can blow it up okay all right now you see it let's go back same photo same photo is is that sinking into y'all this is what I used to remember. Do y'all remember this as well? Hey, you know, straight up, what do you remember? You know, I started this research looking for Captain Crunch. Don't say Captain Crunch anymore either. It says Captain Crunch. Mm -hmm. it, it, it does. Let's see. This one right here. Oh, that ain't it. Where did I go? Um, yeah, you see right here where I did the search. Um, don't want to really lose the page here. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. I'm going to save that right there. Put it in here for right now. I'm going to go back to page. Uh, right here. Everything says Captain Crunch with apostrophe in instead of a T. Now, let's see if I can change this to a. T. <laughs> see if it comes up. Hmm. Still, same thing. I don't see nothing as well than Captain Crunch. Now, it may take hours to find because it took me hours to find that other one as well. In fact, let's go back in here get the link and we're gonna go back into here and here it is all right now we got it now you see I got it in search for 1970 and do you see anything that says Captain Crunch it all says Captain Crunch. Hmm. I mean, very old photos. I mean, old. Like this one. <sighs> Captain Crunch. 1987. Does that make any sense to y'all? They even give us a date, didn't they? Yeah. But, but that's what I mean, folks. What the hell is going on? I mean, really. We're worried about who this person is and what this person's name is. Create troll wars because the truth is starting to come out, but we're all focusing on bullshit. I, I really don't get it. I, I don't. Uh, I don't care. That's another story, another game, another party. But as y'all see, it says Captain. Not Captain. Or, 
I, I don't know. It just seems a little strange that it's everything's changing, folks. And I really mean that. I mean, if we go back over here, you'd see this one right here, right? It's this photo. Now, you see all the rest of them here? None of these are spelt the right way. They're not spelt like this. There was a couple in here that I saw that was spelt similar, but eh, it was a foreign box. I mean, it was from another country, and it was spelt different because that's the way they spell it there. Which I'm looking for at this present time, which is only somewhere. I just don't quite know where. This page goes for ever. Hundreds of photos. But as you see, all of them have been changed. And I don't see the damn thing. And I apologize because it takes time to look through them to find it. Somewhere, somewhere. I may have passed it. But it's here. Trust me. On this page. It's on the URL. Well, damn. I'm checking something here. And that ain't nothing that I want to check. Just thought it might have something in it. Now, earlier when I did this, it was a foreign name of the cereal, of the Fruit Loops, spelled U T I. But I don't see it now. Hmm. That's weird. Hey, look at there. Fruit rings. Huh. Never seen that one. That's weird. Must be another cereal brand. See, here's one. I don't know what language that is, but you see it. Hey, look at here. Another Fruit Loops. A little wild. But that ain't the right name. <clears throat> Here, there's two Fruit Loops. Look at there. There's another one. But look at all the rest of them. They're all spelled different. Oh, here it is right here. See? But it's a different language. Well, this one is too. I'm sorry. Uh, I apologize. I'm going to spell it different too. That's the, the F R U I T uh, T I. It's like I said a while ago. 
But do you see, folks? This is some weird shit. I mean, you can drive yourself nuts with this. Now, there you go. Now, you saw what I'd done with this one a while ago. We checked it, and it took us over here, and it spelled just like that. We can go back to the page. You can see it. We clicked on it. When we clicked on this page, or this link, it took us over here to the source of the picture it's supposed to be, right? And this is what it looks like. Can you believe it? Let's view, let's view the image one more time, okay? Just, just one more time. See, it doesn't change. It's still the same. F-R-O-O-T. But on the image search photo, it used to be this photo. It's one that got missed. Isn't that strange, folks? Do you see anything? Oh, yeah, by the way. Everybody else is taking their turn at trying to do their diligence and tell you information that actually I was the one that told you about it to start with. And they're getting the views, of course. They got my video. Let's see. Let's go back here. All right, here. Got 513 views. Really? Somebody else put this information out and they got shit. 500. They already got 100, about 280, about 280 thumbs up already, even though they ain't got 1,500 views or that's what they had at the time. That's kind of strange to me. But hey, just wanted to let y'all know, as you see, look at this. This is one, and this is one. Do you see the difference? See that? We're changing. This has been within the last couple of hours. Let's open another one, just so you get get the, the gist of what I'm trying to tell you. They haven't shut down. Now look, here's one, here's one, here's one. That's three in a row. Now they ain't shut shit down. No, sir, really. They gonna give you some more Mandela effect. Now, I want you to pay attention to these two photos right here. And this one right here today says, standby, has ever since I've been home today. But if we go back over here to my page, Look what's missing off that page. This one's missing. This one's missing. And this one. And this one. But now they gave us some different ones. They gave us this one and this one and this one and this one. This one's new. And the other two are completely gone. They're not showing anything on this chart today. We can go here, and it don't change, although we got three of them lit up. Uh-huh. They got three of them lit up today. They got all this cut off. They've had it off all day. Or half day. Or is it just another lie? I mean, we see what they're doing here, and here, and here. And we see what's happening to our world with a box of Fruit Loops hmm. and Captain Crunch or Captain Crunch. I remember it called Captain Crunch, but now it says Captain Crunch. <coughs> Oscar Mayer Wiener. I don't know, folks. Huh. It's like everything else. 
That's like talking about freedom in Act 1871. And everybody knowing what it is, seeing it, being shown. And as much as it's shown, the further back in history it seems to go. Isn't that weird? Is it that no one wants to know? Or is it time is changing? I don't know, folks, but hey, you know, we can bicker, argue, mumble, and groan against each other all we want. We can. But is it going to free us? Are we going to be able to stop something like this crazy ass machine that you see going on right here? This one, this one, and this one. Or like Obama said the other night, I did a good job in destroying the, the, the Republic. Well, he didn't do it by himself. He had lots of help. Does anybody care about the Republic? Don't seem that way. Or is it this machine? Are we traveling in time? More so than we know. It does travel at the speed of light. Einstein did say that time travel was possible. Or is they putting something in their particles to change the past? Is that, is that what it's doing? Even though they may be able to change or go in the future and not know what to put in there. But is it possible? Is the particle so small that no one can read it except for under a microscope and put it in there and it collides and it, it goes out into the atmosphere? It distorts and goes. Is it possible? It's starting to look that way. Wouldn't you say? I mean, something's up about this. When you click on it, it takes you to this photo. And this is the original page, photo, right? In fact, let's save this image. Let's do it live so everybody knows that I'm saving. Okay, well, look at that. I already saved it. Ain't that awesome? I gave it a different name, but... I got it, right? So let's see if that one eventually changes too. That'll let it be. You know, folks, I've just been talking and telling you things that I see. I hope you enjoy it. I really do. So with that, from my cold, dead hands, abolish corporate government for your freedoms. Don't forget to like, to like the page, to share the page. Also, to subscribe to the YouTube channel and make sure that you come over to the website. And you can go here. You go to the main page, which will be here whenever it gets there. Come over here to the main page, and you can see bunches of a bunches of different stories. Oh, pass You got 18 more pages to go. There's 75 on each page. <coughs> so make sure you come here and see them. I did this so you, all of you, could see what I've posted. For years. So make sure you come here, favor up the page, share it, to like it, share it, whatever you need to do, folks. So, with that, this time, 
from my cold dead hands and all his corporate government for your feelings. Much love to y'all. Y'all all have a great day now, you hear? At around 5.30 a.m. on Friday, April 29, 2016, a small beach marten found its way onto a large, open-air electrical transformer situated above ground at CERN, causing a short circuit and cutting the power to part of the Large Hadron Collider, LHC. The concerned part of the LHC stopped immediately and safely. Since then the entire machine has remained in standby mode. When the little animal jumped onto the transformer, it created a small electrical arc, damaging high-voltage transformer connections. Many of CERN's sites are located in the countryside and similar events have happened a few times in the past. They are part of life of such an accelerator, as with any large industrial installation. A team assessed the situation over the weekend and found no indication of damage inside the transformer. Repairs to the connections are hoped to be completed by the end of the week, as the LHC continues to prepare for the 2016 physics run. As CERN's physics program has evolved and expanded, physicists at the laboratory have used more powerful accelerators and detectors to study the fundamental particles. The laboratory has had to innovate to keep up with electrical demands. CERN uses 1.3 terawatt-hours of electricity annually. That's enough power to fuel 300,000 homes for a year in the United Kingdom. But the energy needed changes from month to month as the seasons shift and the experimental requirements are adjusted. At peak consumption, usually from May to mid-December, CERN uses about 200 megawatts of power, which is about a third of the amount of energy used to feed the nearby city of Geneva in Switzerland. The Large Hadron Collider, LHC, runs during this period of the year, using the power to accelerate protons to nearly the speed of light. CERN's power consumption falls to about 80 megawatts during the winter months. Changing requirements. That's a lot of electricity where does it come from? The answer has changed over the years. When CERN was established in 1954, a substation on the Swiss side of the campus was enough to meet the electrical needs of the laboratory. Electricity comes into a substation from a power plant and is redirected to where it is needed, like commuters switching trains. As the site and the science program grew, CERN's planners revisited how the laboratory was powered. In the 1970s, a line was installed to connect a new substation on the French side of CERN to an interconnection substation 35 km to the west. This substation is part of the European network. The French station now powers all of CERN, but the Swiss substation is maintained as a partial backup. Superconducting wires to save energy the main line, made of copper, has high energy yields, but it loses some energy on its journey to the internal magnet feeders through electrical resistance, and when it is cooled to the temperatures needed in the LHC. To tackle this energy loss problem, superconducting wires made of niobium-titanium (NBTI) are used on the LHC to connect electromagnets to their power supply. The wires can conduct 100 times the current of traditional copper wire because when cooled to close to absolute zero they offer no resistance to electricity. This greatly cuts down on the energy lost as electricity travels down the wire. To reach a superconducting state, LHC magnets are maintained at 1.9 K, minus 271.3 degrees Celsius, temperatures colder than outer space by a closed liquid helium circuit. The copper wire on the left is 11 cm high, 8 cm wide and 28 cm long. It can conduct a current of 12,500 amps at room temperature. When cooled to 1.9 K, the niobium-titanium coil on the right enters a superconducting state and can conduct the same current, image, CERN. As electricity courses from its source to the LHC, it passes through a temperature gradient. Water cools the copper cables to ease the conversion from room temperature to the cryogenic atmosphere maintained around the accelerator. Currently, the main cost of superconductivity is the cooling process. Whatever energy is earned through the use of superconducting wires is lost in the energy needed to cool the wires. But CERN researchers are working on a way to use superconducting cables for the entire journey from source to magnet, which would lower the energy required to cool the wires.